this angle is just like everything. I mean, am I right? Get in, we're going shopping. <laughs> All right, here we go. All products that I can find will be listed below. Okay, so the first thing that I tried on was an activewear, and these are the Aloe Airbrush Leggings. I've never tried these on before, but I loved them. They fit true to size. Like it says on here, I am a size six and I got a small. So if you're in the four, six range, then the small would probably be best for you. They were tight, but they weren't too tight. I mean, they're leggings, they're supposed to be tight. The cool thing about these was the texture of them. They seemed like really high quality leggings that you could wear to work out in, or you could wear during the day for athleisure. Loved them, loved them. The next thing is something that I thought for sure I was going to purchase. These are the Sala CC high waist leggings. As you can see, they are distressed. I didn't love them as much as I thought that I would. I just kind of felt like a stuffed sausage in them because they are leggings, so they are tight. And so it kind of makes your legs look like they're a busted can of biscuits. But um, my legs aren't like super physically fit, so they may work for a lot of people. Or if you just really like the pants and... Um, it's something that you're okay with, then go for it. But I just didn't feel super confident in these, so I'm gonna have to say no. They did run true to size. I tried on a small and a medium, and I felt both ways with the leg situation, but uh, they are true to size, so I would get a small. I didn't find this top extremely flattering. It's cute, but I think if you have a larger chest, it's just not very flattering. Uh, it made me look bigger than what I am, so I didn't end up getting this. These are these tops are always a great deal during the sale, but I just don't think that they are the best quality. It is kind of like that crepey fabric material and it was see-through, so you'd need to wear a tank underneath. This next one I loved. It's that pajama style top with the black piping on the outside and then the collar looks very pajama top inspired. It is a button down and it is a little bit see-through so you'd have to wear a tank underneath, but I just thought this was the cutest thing ever. I thought it could be dressed up or dressed down and I could definitely wear this to work. The fit was really nice and flattering. Okay, this next sweater I actually really like. It's a very affordable pullover sweater. It's very soft, it's not itchy, and I really like the color of it too. You'll see in a second here that you can see the lace on my bra underneath it, so you might wanna wear a cami underneath, but I would suggest sizing down. I tried on an extra small to get this kind of fit, and it can be worn off the shoulder as well, and so I just think it's super cute. It's a good sweater for here in Southern California because we don't get super cold weather, so I could get a lot of use out of this. I actually really, really like this pick, and it does come in extra, or it does come in, in other colors as well. And as you can see by the look on my face, I was not a fan of this one. I tried to tie the bow a little bit tighter and it still was not flattering. See how I'm holding it right here? That's how I would have loved it to fit. If it fit like that, I would have bought it in every color, but I just didn't find it very flattering and I think it made me look bigger. It's very flowy and it kind of has a stiff material, so it doesn't really cling to any skin. Eh. If you're looking for some basic tees, these were pretty good ones. I always say go big or go home for the Nordstrom sale because as you can see from the price, you're not getting that much savings, but these were really great. They fit good. They were a little bit see-through, so you would have to wear a cami underneath if you didn't mind showing off your bra, but they had a bunch of colors. I was not a big fan of this, but it might be because I have a larger chest. I just felt like it was kind of uncomfortable. Also, it does come with a cami underneath it, but the cami is very low cut. So if you were planning on wearing this to work or some sort of professional environment, then it may not be the best option for you. Uh, it was really tight around my neck too. I love these sunglasses. I talk about this brand all the time. These are the Lispec The Prince and they are flat lenses. They are reflective. These are the gold on gold that are available for the sale. They are more affordable than other brands too, more affordable than Ray-Bans anyways. And so I highly recommend these for the sale. Okay, so we have two things on this page. The first thing is this pair of jeans. These are the AG Farrah High Waist Skinny. I absolutely love these. Uh, I think I'm wearing a 28 in this picture, but I think I actually went with the 27. They are a wine colored jean, so cute for the fall and I find that these do not stretch out. The sweater was super cute too. I tried this on in a small and it's not itchy. It feels really nice. It's something that you can wear all winter long and I loved this whole outfit. The shoes I loved too. I'll talk about those later. <laughs> 
You guys know I love these tops. Look at the smile on my face, it says it all. These are the most comfortable shirts I own and I would like to have them in every color. I think they're very flattering as long as you don't get them too oversized. I got this in a small and this is in the midnight, bur burgundy midnight color. Ugh, they're just amazing shirts. These are a great find during the sale. I usually get at least one or two of these every year. I missed out on one color that I wanted last year. This is the BP Lightweight Rib Stitch Cardigan. It's a really good quality for the price. I don't find it itchy. It is pretty soft and you can just throw these on over any t-shirt and you look put together. Love them, highly recommend. And then this is the other color that I did purchase. I purchased both, both of these. Uh, this is the color that I wanted last year and I missed out on. So these do sell out quickly. If you're interested, jump on it now. This is a top that I was kind of disappointed in. As you can see, it's very thin material. So you can see every bump and lump. And the back has this cute button up uh, thing in the back, but the buttons come up too high. So you can see a little bit of your skin I wanted to wear it to work, but I don't think it'll work for that. And then the collar just didn't lay down flat. As you can see, it's kind of lumpy. I just don't didn't think that this was very good quality at all. And we have another Rails top. Uh, I did purchase this one too, in the same size, a small, and I love the color of this one. And then these rag and bone jeans actually surprised me. They were really nice. They come out in the sale every year, and these are more of a boyfriend style fit, but they're not so oversized that they look sloppy. So I actually really liked them. They do have a raw edge hem, and they're super cute. This shirt was cute. I just don't think it was very flattering on me. Uh, I think it made my shoulders look wider than what they really are because of that ruffle detail. But I do like the bottom part of this, how the buttons don't go all the way down. I think that part is actually very flattering, uh, but it just wasn't for me. But this could be a really great work shirt. This is one of my favorite picks from the sale. This is the Chelsea 28 Military Bomber Jacket. I've been on the hunt for a cute bomber jacket and I love the olive green color. It fits really well. I think it's pretty flattering and I love the military detail on the front of it. It just gives it something extra. Love this. I wanted to update you guys on these. I didn't even try them on because I could tell they were just not good quality. They were a basic cotton legging like what you'd wear in elementary school. <laughs> I didn't think they were impressive. This is another favorite pick from the sale. I got this in the extra small small. It's so soft. I could see myself wanting to wear this every single day. I kind of want to pick up the gray color too. It is just so cozy and I, there are no words. You guys need this. Trust me, you need one of these. I know in my last video I said that I didn't really recommend getting super trendy pieces, but I just couldn't help myself with this one. It's super cute and I did think it was more flattering than the previous Lush top I tried on. It is a little bit see-through, so you do need to wear a cami underneath and I sized up in this. I am wearing a medium here, so oh, it's super cute. I love this top. I love this bag. This is a great find and you guys, this will sell out super duper fast. So get your hands on it if you're interested. It's a nice suede material. I love the color. I know I'll get a lot of use out of it in the fall and it's the perfect size for me. If you don't carry around a ton of stuff, this is an awesome buy. So now into shoes. I tried these on and I forgot to take good pictures of them to show you, but I love these. I'm usually an eight and a half, these are an eight and a half, or the ones that I tried on were, they're so cute. And at first I couldn't tell if they were really ugly or really cute, but hear me out. I think if you wear them with just black pants and a black top and throw in some different black textures in there, I think that they would be so cute and they would kind of bring some uh, something to the outfit. So I love these and they come in a ton of other colors. So these are always a good buy during the sale because as you can see, they're 300 right now after the sale, 498, like that's crazy. And these always sell out super fast. So if you're even thinking about getting these, then I would hop on the bandwagon right away. Uh, I had to order these online because I didn't have them in my size in store. So I can't really give you any information about sizing, but I just ordered the same size that I usually order when I get my Tory Burch flats. So hopefully sizing works out okay. Okay, so these are a great find. I actually bought these last year or at least something very similar to them. And during the anniversary sale, these sold out super fast as well. So I would recommend these. I did try these on in store. I just didn't get good pictures of them, but they are super comfortable. It doesn't feel like a four inch heel at all. And they're super cute. I love the detail on the front of the boot. 
It's a block heel, so it's more comfortable than a regular heel, and it just dresses up any outfit. The slits on the side are very elongating to the leg. I can't say enough good things about these boots.